My name is Michael Pluse. I'm a psychologist at Queen Mary University of London in the United Kingdom. Uh, my research focuses on investigating individual differences in sensitivity to experiences people make. Now, most people have the same experiences, but they differ in how they respond to it. So we have known for a long time that some people seem to be more affected by negative experiences, such as trauma, loss and abuse. Uh, but recently we also have been able to show that those same people that are more affected by negative experiences seem to be particularly responsive to positive experiences such as social support, uh, positive parenting and psychological interventions. So my research aims at investigating and understanding those individual differences in sensitivity better. So the first thing that we are looking at is how can we measure sensitivity in the best way possible. Then we also try to understand what predicts those differences, to what degree is it genetic. And then we want to apply that by trying to understand who are the individuals, the children, but also adults that are particularly sensitive to negative and positive experiences. What we have found so far is that sensitivity is a trait that is measurable. We can measure it with questionnaires, we can measure it with uh, behavioural observation. Um, we also found that it is a genetic trait, it has a substantial genetic component, but it's not purely genetic, also environmental experiences throughout life shape the degree of sensitivity people have. And we found that people that are more sensitive are more responsive to psychological intervention. Uh, children that are more sensitive are more affected by positive parenting and um, children that are more sensitive are also more affected in a negative way by war trauma. And we think it's really important given that those differences affect how people respond to various experiences that they make to include that concept of sensitivity in both research and practice.